GI and welcome everybody, Sunny here, Gandhiji.io. We're going to go through today how to use your or how to get your passphrase um, and change your wallet, your mobile wallet, from a Cypher wallet to a Trust wallet or the new Coinbase wallet app as well. Both are DAP browsers. So if you just follow along in this video, I will show you how to go through the whole process basically. So well, you'll see here, I'm going to start off in Cypher. Um, if you just unlock your Cypher wallet, we'll go through here. I want you to note here the, the wallet address OX88E2 uh, and the amount of Ethereum we have in this wallet is 0.002 Ethereum. I'll just show you here on the Gandhiji website. So we'll click the browser icon in the left hand corner. And then I'm just going to quickly type here gandhiji.io forward slash ind to take me straight through to the exchange page. And this is all done within Cypher. DAP. Just wait for this to load up here and I'll show you that in this particular wallet here, we have a total of 0.48 IND tokens. So now what we need to do is find the settings tab on the bottom right hand corner. Click here. We're going to click on recovery phrase and we will need to now click on lock wallet and just enter our passcode again. Some of you may have this set up with a, a touch, a fingerprint, but we're going to take that and be sure obviously not to show anybody these words your these are your 12 word private keys you should keep them safe and away from prying eyes at all times once we've got those copied um i'll then show you there ethereum in the wallet 0.002 we're then going to find google play store or uh, if you're with apple then uh, you can obviously go to the app store type in the search trust wallet and you'll see the shield icon come up here. We'll click that, select install. We'll run through the installation process here, guys, and you'll see um, this will get set up quite quickly for us. It's only a small file. There we go. We're going to open this application now. Trust wallet and for the first time when you open it you do get the option either you can create a new wallet but what we're doing today is uh, importing a wallet so we're going to click on I already have a wallet we'll select from here multi coin wallet and enter the passphrase that we got from cypher we'll click import and that will import this wallet into trust wallet See that's imported, click done. And what this will do now is this will show us our balance in Ethereum. There we go, you can see. Click Ethereum 0.002 OX 88 So that's the same account. If we go across now, click the DAP button in the bottom. Once again, enter Gandhiji.io website address. And when this loads up, you'll you'll see the same 0.48 IND token balance. There we go, 0.48 IND token. So you can see we've just shifted from Cypher to Trust Wallet. Now, I'll show you again here. If we go into the settings, and this is in Trust Wallet now, click on Wallet. Um, and select these three little dots at the right hand side and you'll be able to then in future show backup phrase and see those keys again. I am actually just gonna copy these here again so you can see our recovery phrase. We're gonna copy this now from here. We'll go back over to uh, the Play Store where I'm gonna just now type and search for Coinbase Wallet App. Now there is a, there's two Coinbases, there's the Coinbase Exchange, but it's the Coinbase Wallet app that we're interested in here because that is the DAP browser. So you can see here it's the icon with a circle, the little square in the middle, 
Coinbase wallet and it's the one that says DAP browser. Again, click install on this one. Just wait a moment for this to install. Again, not a very large file, so it doesn't take up too much space on the, on the mobile device. Available both Apple and Android. There we go. Now the nice thing about Coinbase Wallet, and I'll go through this with you and show you. Um, let's just get this set up. So we again, we're gonna click, I already have a wallet. Restore with recovery phrase. Again, enter the recovery phrase, click next, and that will continue to restore our Ethereum wallet. Accept the terms of service. In this one, you get to choose a username, so let me just enter that quickly. And we're gonna create a pin for added security here. So just for demo, I'm just gonna add one to six here. Confirm that. There we go. So now you can see, just get rid of these small pop ups. And we'll be able to see that the same Ethereum account has been added 0.002 Ethereum balance. Um, that's wallet one. So I'll just go through, click that browser in the center again. And this will take us to the browser page where we can visit gundiji.io website to then see our IND token balance as well. Now remember we're looking for 0.48 IND tokens that are in this particular wallet address. See once the lo website loads up here, we'll be able to go down and now Coinbase wallet app is also connected to the same wallet address so that's how you go through guys and uh, set all that up on individual wallets there is one extra feature I'd like to show you here if we go into settings um, advanced what we can actually do with this one is select which wallet is our active wallet it gives us the option to select up to 10 different wallets that are associated with the same account so at that point you can then uh, go ahead and select whichever act wallet you'd like to be active and that will then show the IND token balances you have on that wallet. Okay guys, if you need any further information, feel free to get in touch. Sunny here, Gandhiji.io. Jai Hind, Jai Bharat.